left my desk computer job and, and came here to farm. It's been a pathway of success through the years for Jason Saylor, from Penn State grad to construction project engineer, turned farmer for conservation right here in Perry County, Pennsylvania. Jason's father-in-law is the original owner of this farm that's been in the family for about 150 years. I ventured into the engineering field and met my wife and we got married and, and I started helping my father-in-law out on the weekends and I got more and more interest in farming. Oh, it's, it's great, it's very rewarding work. And the Natural Resources Conservation Service, or NRCS, is helping him help the land. They come out and give you their advice and, and help administer the projects and they'll lead you through the project from start to finish. The crops here mainly are corn, soybeans and hay. We also have a beef operation and then we also have a poultry operation. NRCS has been a great help in assisting us and helping us to design the project. Sailor is a two-time Chesapeake Bay Watershed Initiative participant. Through this effort, farmers, ranchers, and forest land owners voluntarily install conservation practices on hundreds of thousands of acres annually to help support rural economies, protect wildlife habitat, and improve water quality. The practices are proven to make a difference. NRCS has worked with this gentleman to do some pasture improvements. So we've done pipeline and watering facilities. We've also been working with them on a dry stack manure storage for poultry litter. There's some beef cattle also on the property. I've seen a, a much better distribution of the nutrients from the cows on the field. Meanwhile, private landowners all across the nation are encouraged to reach out to NRCS for assistance. They're just a phone call away. Well, I don't think you always realize that you're making a difference, but, um, but you are because you have an impact on um, all the private landowners and farmers that you're working with, teaching them things about the value of clean water and the streams, uh, teaching them how not to uh, compact their soil, how to better utilize their grassland for feed for their cattle. It's very challenging. It's very hands-on and you're working with nature and, and the elements and it's, it's all rewarding for me and, and very enjoyable. Kim Betton, U.S. Department of Agriculture, Natural Resources Conservation Service.